So everybody has their own style of dragon. My style speed wise is anywhere from 0.4 to 0.78. My sweet spot for me is 0.6. Is what I do the best. Winter time I slow that down to about 0.4. Um, there's a bunch of little tricks to dragon. I mean everybody thinks it's just come right here dragon but actually it is an art form. Um, I have different weights, different sizes, different uh, weights, so I could change my presentation. Winter time, when you bring your catfish in and they uh, have mud on the side, that means they're buried in the mud, so you want to slow down and get the uh, bait closer to the bottom, because if it's too far away, they're not going to put the effort into getting it. I'm kind of watching where I'm going. Um, so I've had a couple of videos on how to I rig, uh, use that tire run six rods. I put four board, uh, four rods on planer board, two on each side. And the reason for that is it makes you able to fish six rods easier. And once you get a fish on, you basically do a rod dance, just move rods instead of reeling one in. If you weren't running planer boards, once you had a fish on, you'd have to reel in at least that side, if not all the rods in, so they don't get tangled like we had this morning, which I will go ahead and unfortunately put on the video so you know what I'm talking about. So uh, the side ones, we basically do eye. I used to do 30 feet and then planer boards, do one at 90, do one at 60, try to get 50 feet between each of them so you have a chance to move it. And the back ones, I usually run around 200 to 150 or 175 to 125 kind of uh, all depends what we're set at and uh, now we do just set the planer board by sight I've done it enough and my guys know uh, about where to go and if, if I have a gut feeling that says something's wrong I'll go ahead and let a little bit more out so that's how I set up and we'll get you a couple more demos Well, welcome back to the channel. We're out here at Clear Lake catfishing. Uh, if you watched my last striper uh, trip, you know I have the Snagum Bagum uh, crew. Got Matt and Pops. They're good uh, family friends. So we're doing a catfish product video. So throughout this video, we'll show you a product that we have, what he's gonna have, and how to properly use it. So I hope we get you some action. All right, guys. So like Ken said, today we're out on uh, Ken's boat fishing for some clapped catfish. Uh, we were out Tuesday fishing for striper, doing a product unveil for our lures. Today we're going to be talking throughout the day. We're going to talk about... Thirteen nine three. That guy, that is PB, and what's so special about PB is I bet if they've got PB, they buy me lunch today, so I get free lunch. <laughs> I mean, previously it was only five pounds, so I kind of knew even if I caught bait, I would beat that. <laughs> but yeah, there you go. All right, as I was saying before we got interrupted with that fish, throughout the day we're gonna do a little product announcement. We're changing stuff up how we do our floats. So we have three different tier series. Uh, Ken will go into that one. He'll start into that and then I'll elaborate on top of what he's saying. We're going to show you guys what we have today. Some new colors we got coming out. We're going to talk about those. Just enjoy the day. Enjoy the, enjoy the video. That was about, whoop. Yep, fish on. Got it? He's there. Okay, pops. <laughs> We're gonna put the ice chest up in the front deck when, when Yeah, you go. You guys go back there in the sun. You hand me my phone. So we just hit a double, eleven three three and a twelve nine nine. We got a another one in the box. Let's go. Stop. Relax. There you go. You want this 
pump up? Yeah, go ahead and get it. Another, another nice fish. Captain didn't reel it in though. My deck hands are. Okay, Sean. Pop, come here. Eleven three three. Another eleven three three. Another one. Going back in the water. I broke my personal best, so I don't, I'm happy. The rods are letting you fight the fish, there's and there's another one. All right, Captain's fish. Still not as big as mine, though. So I, obviously, as you can see, uh, haven't had a chance to do too much talking about it because we've been drilling in fish. But one thing that Snag and Bagum is going to do is basically a three-tier system on Snag and Bagum floats for catfish. You get them with leaders or without. First one will be stock colors. There'll be four or five colors. Plus, he's doing a three-pack of peg floats for $9.99 in a signature series, which will have approximately five to ten floats. There will be more detail that show the scales, the gills, everything else. Then he will have a elite series, which are the custom one-offs. If you want something custom painted, uh, let them know, and that's will be the elite series. And when you order uh, leaders from Snag and Bagum, understand that his pro staff are some of the top elite tournament anglers out there. And the leaders you get are the ones that we are using in during tournaments. There's a couple of tweaks that each person does their own. Oh, we also, looks like we got a fish on. So trust me, the leaders that you get are the same, wow, ones, that are, the same ones that we are What's using on during the side, tournament. Man. All right, you guys, while we were doing our talking, this little guy decided he wanted to play. You guys can see these leaders are no joke. They work, they put fish in the boat consistently time and time again. This is our second drift, and we lost count of how many fish we actually put in the boat. We're starting drift two. First drift we got, you bound to turn to do something on my toes. Um, Sorry about that. I got a deck mate that's stepping on my toes, standing metal rod parts in my toes. Uh, so uh, drift one got us about 10 fish. Uh, biggest 13, smallest we're going to keep is like seven, eight. Everything else was released. So we'll see what we get on drift two. Guys, I'm going to elaborate on what Ken said about our three tier system for 2024. We're going to have stock colors. We're going to have five stock colors. We're also gonna have a signature series and we're gonna have five of those. One of the signature series I'm gonna talk about today is the Goodfellas Gill, this, this guy right here. Uh, this has been a big, big, big color for us. It's been a big productive color for a lot of these guys out here. These packages, when you get them, all you gotta do is open them up, un unravel, hook them to your rod, hook your favorite bait on, put your weight on, start dragging. These, are, these come right off the bat with hooker's terminal tackle let me put this bag down real quick hooker's terminal tackle we got an adop backstabber we also have their ball chain swivel right in the middle and we have a hooker's terminal tackle three-way it's all tied on p-line with a rattle you can go to our website snagamabagam.com these are on the website right now i do have some in stock that are ready to ship out you don't have to wait for me to paint them check them out find a find somebody that you've been fishing or been fishing on clear lake Ask them how they like them. They'll tell you they love them. Check it out. I only want one guy. That has a three pack. No, just tell no, them I don't want that. I like these rods. These are. Oh. <laughs> I like these rods. I'm gonna need the net, 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 net. Okay, just keep down. Relax. Calm your panties. Yeah. Go ahead.
21. Sweet. 21 pounds? 21 pounds. Got you a 20. 21 pound. Unfortunately, he let this one kind of swim around because we had other fish on. And unfortunately, he swallowed down the gills. So we're going to go ahead. I just cut the hook off. We're going to go ahead and keep this one. I don't want to release it and have him die later on today. So this will be the last one we keep. So we're gonna go ahead and call our show. Had a great day. We put about 30 fish in the boat. Yep. Lunch time on snag and bag them. Hey. Now total all I gotta do is put BBs. They both got PBs. Matt got 21 something. Pop's got a 19 something. We broke it about three, four times with 30 fish. So we're out here. Tight lines. See you next time. Have a good one. <laughs>